Gravity Sketch is an immersive design tool. What we've seen with 3D modeling in the past is that it's very logical, very mathematical, very difficult to access platform. Uh, it's really hard to get started, it's really hard to do work as a designer and as an artist rather than an engineer. So what we tried to do was to make it accessible and easy to use. One of the places we started was with an iPad app. That was pretty cool. You could draw in 3D, but still using you know, something flat, like a pen, and it felt quite natural. But it was still very hard to understand what 3D really meant. And so a couple of years ago, we basically picked up VR, picked up immersive technology, and found that it's kind of this magical space where 3D suddenly makes sense to anyone. We put on the headset, and everything that was 3D on a screen is now 3D around you. And there's this magical moment where so everyone's eyes light up that you know you just see it, the whole perspective of what drawing in 3D means to them change. The biggest difference between um, this type of design and kind of the old school techniques is just how quick you can work and how much control the designer has over the 3D step in the workflow. So like a very traditional approach is drawing with pen and paper or Photoshop, and then you give that to the CAD guy, and the CAD guy will turn your drawing or, or sketch into a 3D model. And then there's kind of like a back and forth cycle where those two people have to communicate the idea, refine it, figure it out in 3D, and solve lots of spatial challenges. Uh, and that takes a lot of time, and also it takes some of the control out of the designer's hands when you start to reach a 3D stage. If you kind of think about everything that people design, it's all 3D. You know, everything around us in the world is a three-dimensional object. So letting people take that further towards actually making a production model or even just prototyping it in virtual reality can save a ton of time and let the designers do better work. The biggest challenge for collaboration is uh, latency. Even like a tiny bit of latency, for example, 500 millisecond latency in uh, real-time co-sketching, that means uh, it could cause uh, some users motion sick. So AWS enable us to provide this low latency, near real-time communication between users, even cross continent. My favorite quote was, was um, from one of the artists who, who was trying out collaboration for the first time. Uh, and they, were, they had one office in the States and one office in the UK. Um, and he said, like, you know, about five minutes in, we had to like stop everything and pause the whole thing and get out, you know, get out the, the video capture, get out the, the cameras and record that moment because they felt like they were actually feeling innovation, you know, they, they were feeling what the next step of design is going to be. And, 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 you know, they had to capture it um, because they thought it would go down in history. And to me, that's like, it's, it's so motivating to see people use and love our tool. Um, that's definitely the best thing, the coolest thing.